Hey guys, it is Kevin here in Japan, walking along in Osaka, showing you some sights and sounds, because um, I know that's what you guys like to see. And uh, since I am in a new location, every time I walk around a corner, I'm exploring and seeing something new too. So uh, we're learning together. So how are you guys doing? So here's the deal. Now I'm just going to turn the camera around in a moment so you guys can actually just kind of see the, enjoy the scenery and take in the scenery in HD. Check it out, by the way, in HD. It's the best way to do it. Um, but I want to talk to you about improving your quality of life. Now I'm going to turn the camera around and talk about this. So improving your quality of life. And the reason why I talk about this, improving your quality of life, and check out this parking lot, man. This is pretty rad. Got a lone office chair in there. So the reason why I want to talk about improving your quality of life is I get a lot of emails from people who say, and over the years, and, and they send them to me on my YouTube and on my Facebook, they say, Kevin, I hate my life where I am. I want to come to Japan and make a better life. I want to, my life sucks where I'm at, and if I go to Japan, everything will be better. <clears throat> Which it may or may not, but probably not in a way. For example, like if you live in a country where, for example, it's war-torn, or there's lots of crime, or it's like actually physically dangerous to be there, well then, you know, Japan is a very safe country, and your quality of life probably would definitely improve. But if, if, if life sucks for you, or you're having just a lot of personal issues, um, those are the kind of things that you need to sort out by yourself, and I think changing a geographic locale won't fix personal issues. It might allow you to run away from them and hide for a while, but hiding never really fixes an issue, does it? It just... You put it off. It's like procrastinating. Procrastinating and dealing with an issue. So if you have trouble finding relationships and meeting people, you have, you know, issues with money, maybe you have a lot of debt, well, running away to another country isn't going to help your debt. You just kind of, you have debt in a different place. If you're not good with money, and say, for example, if you're a Canadian like me, if you're not good with money in Canada, you're probably not going to be good with money in Japan. Just because you change locations doesn't make it better. That's something that you need to work on yourself. Become a better financial manager. Um, if you have some kind of substance abuse problem in the country you're from, well, there's a good chance that you could probably, you know, have a substance abuse problem in Japan. It might be a different substance, but it could be a substance abuse problem nonetheless. Um, yeah, so it's it's kind of when when people send me messages like that, it it I don't know it's. <laughs> I kind of shake my head. Now, Japan is a cool place. Now, if, if you're just living kind of a mundane existence wherever you are, and we all go through that from time to time, periods of our life, if, if you consider the problem just being you don't like where you live because it's a mundane existence, maybe you live in a rural area, a small town, and life's just not interesting, you want some spice, you want to make life more interesting, well, definitely Japan is a cool place to come because it is interesting, and it is definitely, if you've never been to an Asian country, fascinating and very different from what you know. So if that's the case, I say come on over and enjoy yourself. Um, it's great. But again, if, if you're one of these people who maybe has some kind of personal, deep personal issues, those are things you probably need to work out yourself in some form, some fashion. Um, and again, just kind of changing your geographic location probably won't fix that up. I think, in my opinion. My two cents. Well, there we go, guys. I hope you enjoyed the scenery. Me walking around Namba, the Namba area of Osaka. Kevin here on the Jalen Kev channel. See you later. Actually, I'm going to put some of the Boost on Kevin channel. There we go. All right. Take it easy, guys. Kevin here in Japan in a non-edited one-shot street walking video.